With the rising population in the commercial city of Onitsha and its environs, environmental sanitation challenges has been on the increase. This has necessitated the continuous sanitation exercise in different areas of Anambra state. Now, Governor Willie Obiano at the Abuja Park in Onicha to educate the residents on the need to keep their environment clean. And he leads by example. The plastics, the uh, water sachets, you should put together into a different can and so that uh, when the people picking the garbage will come, they will take them away. There are things that are blocking the drainage and causing many havoc on our roads and uh, uh, houses through flood. From the Abuja Park, the special sanitation campaign team moves to another area. Here, both residents and sanitation officers are cleaning up the area. While some want government to help them, others believe residents also have a role to play. What we need government to do is to support us with the environmental equipment and other things. We are paying for ANSPA, but no ANSPA people. We are paying 3,600 naira. No bucket, no nothing. First of all, is to inculcate the habit of using refuse bags, first of all, from domestic waste you have in the houses. Make sure that they put their waste into those uh, waste bags and then empty them in the receptacles around. Governor Obiano also joins in cleaning Oguta Road on Echa, after which he heads for Opoko in Ogbaru local government area, where the decongestion of blocked drainages commences. This is uh, Sakamori, it's a federal government project which has been abandoned for a long time and therefore uh, it's causing a lot of flood in, to, the, to the community here. You know, and uh, we're trying to relieve them of that challenge by bringing a swamp boogie to see whether they can clean up uh, some of the uh, dragons that are blocking the drainage here. Meanwhile, the state government has assured residents of providing adequate waste evacuation equipment in all the streets and also sufficient manpower. It's also asking them to work with government to make Anambra one of the cleanest states in the country.